Hi, today I'm going to show you how to unlock your Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra from any carrier. This will also work for any other Samsung Galaxy model. Keep in mind that this will not work for phones that have been reported as lost or stolen. If your device is blacklisted, this method will not work. If you're not sure if your phone is blacklisted, I have included a link to a video in the description below where I show you exactly how to find out. So here's how it works. The first step is to find your IMEI number required for this unlock. To find it, go to the dial pad and dial star hash zero six hash. As you will see, the 15-digit IMEI number will show up in the screen of your device. Alternatively, you can find this number in the phone settings or in the original box that it came in. Once you have your 15-digit IMEI number, we're going to switch to a computer or a mobile device with internet connection. Now head over to unlockriver.com where we will use the carrier unlock service. I will include all the links in the description of this video. We'll start by filling in this form. First, select the original network and country that your phone is currently locked to. Then select the brand. Then we will select the exact model that we're trying to unlock. And here's a side note. If you're unlocking a T-Mobile phone, sometimes you will see here the option to select unlock app. That only applies for US T-Mobile devices. Otherwise, just ignore this part. Next, insert the IMEI number. That's the number that we got a few seconds ago. Be sure to enter the email correctly as you will receive the unlock code confirmation here. If you scroll down, you will see the price and the processing time, which will always vary. Let's click unlock now. On the following screen, you will get to see a summary of your order, review that all the information is correct and place your order. After placing your order, you will receive two emails. The first email confirming your order and the second one after the unlock has been successfully completed. The second email should look something like this. In this email, you will receive an unlock code together with instructions to finalize the process. The most important part of this email is the unlock code. So turn off your phone, then insert a new SIM card from a different carrier. If you are using an eSIM, I'll show you a method later. Then restart your phone. It will take a few seconds to recognize the new SIM card and a message will show up requesting the unlock code. If you don't see this message or if you're trying to install an eSIM, go to the dial pad and dial star 74656256638 star hash. This will bring up the message requesting the network unlock code. So go ahead, insert the code and boom. Our Samsung Galaxy has been successfully unlocked and now it's compatible with any eSIM or any SIM card from any country. Now, let's just quickly verify that the phone has been successfully unlocked by making a quick call. Perfect, and that's it. Your phone has been successfully unlocked and now we can use it with any SIM card anywhere in the world. Thank you so much for watching. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.